What up YouTube? Piston Slap here and I got some dust in my eye. No lies. This uh, K3 helmet has a awesome air vent right in the front, right at the chin there. And yeah, anything dirt, dust, it just like right in and into your eyeballs. Like it was meant to be. Did you guys like some corn? I know, that's a corny joke. Uh, <laughs> anyway, um, just thought I'd give you guys a little update. Um, I'm gonna probably slow down just a little bit on the moto vlogs, um, just because one, we're coming into the winter months and I don't ride as much in the winter time as far as up in the mountains and stuff like that. And two, uh, this is probably gonna be the last long trip on these tires. These tires are done. I mean, they were done like a thousand miles ago. But what I consider done, I mean, we're at the wear bars. Some of you guys like to run them down to the cords so though I don't but I still have grooves in the tire so technically it's still okay to ride maybe you guys want to drop a comment in there where do you consider a tire unsafe to ride anymore is it at the wear bar or is it when there's just nothing left at all like you know just completely smooth surface or do you go all the way to the cord get that money's worth for it because tires are expensive and really face it uh, if you're just commuting back and forth to work and you're only going a few miles you know how bad could it really be you know I always like to think about the other end of the scale you know the worst outcome tire comes apart you end up getting a towed back or it goes flat and you end up on a tow truck you know how expensive is a tow bill well if you're in my situation and you're up in the hills, I'm going to assume it's going to be anywhere from $150 to probably around $300 to get towed back to home base or shop or wherever it needs to go. So with that being said, you know, uh, you know, sorry to for my loyal subscribers that uh you know follow me and you know i try to religiously put something up at least every saturday for you guys um it is going to be slowing down uh, i am going to be making a trip to arizona so maybe we can uh commandeer some uh dirt equipment and do some dirt vlogs some dirty some dirty vlogs for you new subscribers thank you for joining me and uh hope you enjoy the content that i'm throwing out there for you uh, and for the ones of you that uh, have uh, came with or started with me from the start, you know, when I had nothing, uh, you guys are the building blocks, man, of this foundation. So, you know, I just wanted to say thank you. I really, really appreciate it. Um, I don't know, like, I was going to do, like, a little burnout or something, you know, just blow the tire completely apart. Something cool. I don't know coming up in a video we'll uh we'll see how that goes i'm i'm really uh what's holding me back on that is i'm really hoping for a tire to come out uh, i've talked about it a few times uh bridgestone finally i thought I've, i'm just basically repeating an old moto vlog but bridgestone uh got in touch with me and said that sometime this fall which should be any day now um that they are releasing the tire that i want which is the s20 evo and the reason I'm being such a stickler about it is that it's a, uh, a three compound tire. You know, it's got a really super hard center. Uh, it's got a, like a medium soft shoulder. And then when you're over in your full, full leans and stuff like that, it's the really nice stop, soft stuff. So I'm really curious as to how it works it out because like my last moto vlog, the burned out center, uh, my center is worn down way more than my uh, shoulders are. And that's where I do a lot of my riding, you know, right now. It's just wearing down the center of my tire. So, thought I'd throw that out there. Other than that, guys, 
Um, it's kind of a little bit scattered, but uh, we're going to go do a little bit of a ride. So I might post a raw video uh, up. And I don't know if I'm going to set it as a fast forward or something, because it's going to be like probably a good hour and something video. So, you know, I, I, I wouldn't expect you to sit through an hour of watching me go down twisty turny canyon roads. Uh, maybe we'll get a stop or something, check out some uh, canyons with some rivers at the bottom. If there is a river, who knows, might be dry today. Uh, and maybe we'll get some cool stuff. So, like I said, you know, I do appreciate you guys, each and every one of you, uh, for watching my content and uh, hitting that like button, you know, throwing your comments down there. Even for you non-subscribers, you know, uh, I try to get down there and, you know, get you guys' questions answered. Uh, if I don't answer it, it's probably because I just don't know what to say or how to reply to it. So, thanks again for watching. I'm Piss and Slap. You guys have a great day. Uh, if you like the video, hit that like button. Share it on your favorite social media. And as always, subscribe to my channel for future uh, events.